Hi, I'm Lizzie Edwards and these are my five time-saving wardrobe and grooming hacks. Now, I work with a lot of very busy women and they want to know all the time how they can just get out of the house quickly in the morning or things they can do to make sure that they look their best without taking too much time. And these are the products again and again I recommend. So the first one is a steamer. Now, I recommend this one. It's a pure steam uh, one. I just bought it off Amazon. Um, as you can see, it's really small, so it's very good for travel. If you're someone who has to travel a lot for work, if you find yourself pulling things out of the suitcase that are a bit creased, this is what you need. So I'm going to just turn it on. You'll see that it heats up really, really fast. Now, I'm not sure if this shows up, but you can see there's a shirt here that's a little bit creased. Um, now, sometimes you just don't want to get the ironing board out. You've got better things to do. So once this is heated up, you just hold it up steam comes out you can just see that the creases just disappear in a matter of seconds really so compared to getting the ironing board out waiting for the iron to heat up if you've got many things that are silk or of drapey fabrics jerseys t-shirting you know, something's still a best with an iron, like if it's cotton shirt that you need really neat edges on, but otherwise, I honestly swear by a steamer, honestly, you'll be all that time you're saving. So that's my number one hack. Number two. So I know that a lot of people will be like, well, what's new? But I can't tell you how many people still, when I tell them about dry shampoo, haven't heard of it. So my number two is Batiste dry shampoo. I know there's loads of other brands out there now, but this is the one that I always go back to. Um, what I love about it now, as you can see, this is a dark one. So for me, I've got darker hair, so this doesn't leave any white residue. For me, it just means that I don't have to be washing my hair just because I've been to the gym and I've got a little bit of greasy roots. Um, I actually prefer my hair after a couple of days anyway, so this really can stretch it out. If you're someone who likes to exercise or you're just prone to having greasy hair, I really recommend um, Batiste. And if you, they've got ones for blondes, they've got ones for different colour, you know, black or light blonde or dark blonde, you know, this is the stuff that I really recommend. Number three. So my number three item is to have a lint roller. Again, a lot of people will be like, what? Tell me something I don't already know, but I can't tell you how many people, they've got things in their wardrobe that have got hairs on, they've got a dog, just bits of dandruff, just stuff that gets collected. A lint roller is an essential for you just to check yourself before you leave the house and give it a roll over the shoulders. You can get these on eBay, Amazon, or even these, I think this one's from um, H&M. So you can get them everywhere. So I really recommend if you don't have one, it's definitely part of your grooming routine is to have a lint roller. Okay, so number four is, now this isn't for everybody. If you're lucky enough not to have any grey hairs yet, well, you don't need to listen to this bit. But if you do have grey hairs, then this is my next hack. Wow root touch up now i've used lots of different products i have gray hair not a huge amount but i have some patches at the front um, and i get my hair done probably every five weeks to get my roots done but sometimes at around week four there's enough of a root for it to be showing but i don't want to have to get to the hairdresser and i don't have time and this is where color wow comes in so it basically is like an eyeshadow um, it's like a little powder with a brush and all you do is you part your hair with a comb particularly around the areas where it falls naturally and you just put the, the powder along the root and along the hairline and it just means that it's not that obvious grey in that in-between stage. So that's the brand that I recommend and that I use and um, you can buy this from Space NK and online and probably in other places as well but that's where I got mine from. And number five of my hacks is again something that people say again tell me something I don't know a debobbler. Lots of people have things in their wardrobe that just look tired and worn, but actually with a little bit of care, they can be brand new again. And one of the things that really helps with that is a debobbler. If you've got bobbly scarves, jumpers, coats, you don't always need to replace them every season. And it, often it isn't about how much you spent on the item. Some expensive cashmere really bobbles. So for me, the electric bobbler is best. If you lay the item flat on the table and just take a bit of care and just run it over, Honestly, the item can look brand new again and you don't, you know, it's just ready to go. So it can take a bit of time. So have a glass of wine, put the telly on, get the debobbler out. It's really satisfying. I know it sounds a bit strange, but it's really satisfying. So a debobbler. Um, this one's a John Lewis one, but you can get them on Amazon, eBay. I don't really know if any are better than others. They're all quite standard. They've got the little thing at the front, electric take AA battery. So that's my number five. 
Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel to be notified when a new video is available and to follow me on Instagram to see more tips and ideas around dressing for work. Bye.